Gentlemen, I reviewed the depositions at issue and I'm prepared to hear arguments. Mr. Barba? The statements which detail bad acts by the defendant show one more example that the crime he's charged with is part of an ongoing and pervasive pattern of behavior. Defense objects. These are unproven allegations from years ago, which were never reported at the time. The state had the opportunity to bring them as criminal charges, but declined to do so. These women's statements clearly show motive and the same MO in each case. The jury needs to hear them to understand that the rape that Coyle is charged with is part of a broader pattern of conduct. The only question before the jury should be the facts of the specific charge. Anything else would be extremely prejudicial in this case. Mr. Barbo, while I find these statements to be important evidence, I agree with defense that in this case it would be more prejudicial than probative. People's motion is denied. Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you, Your Honor. Not the ruling I was hoping for. So where does that leave us? The two witnesses. Heidi Sorensen and George Thanos. Is that enough to go to trial? If I'm willing to go out on a very high, very shaky limb. I assume that's a yes. Damn right it is. <laughs>